G'day everyone and thanks for tuning into the channel. On this video I'm going to be doing some work for Mark on his 52 Chevy truck project. He's got a mount on a HQ chassis, 5 litre uh, turbo 700. Uh, basically going to go yeah pick it up now. He wants it um, plumbed up, get it running, driving and stopping. So yeah let's go get it. Right everyone so we made it home. Um, yeah Mark's driveway was pretty um, pretty steep, pretty full on trying to load this thing but we got there so yeah, this is the this is the truck. Um, I think it's a '52 Chev. Um, he's done all the work at this point. Just needed someone to want someone to come in and wire it up and plumb it and finish most of it off. So yeah, this is it. So HQ chassis, uh, five litre, seven hundred, ten bolt, um, pretty straightforward. So yeah, gonna get stuck into wiring plumbing um everything to make it run and drive essentially so yeah stick with us and um let's rip into it right yeah so it's the next day um what i got done yesterday was i got the power cables made ran them um got the transmission oil cool lines made and um yeah run through the transmission got the intake manifold bolted down um the bolts that were supplied were too long. Uh, I've got another set there, but it's bolted down and sealed up. Um, made and fitted the um, ignition lead, just got the alternator hung there. Um, fan belt's correct. So, um, went to town this morning, got some more supplies. So yeah, gonna, gonna get stuck into them, radiator hoses, thermostat housing, um, and yeah, brakes and the wiring. So yeah, let's get into it. All right, yeah, so, didn't get to feel much uh, yesterday, I just sort of got stuck in it. We had to go to town a couple of times. Um, but as you can see, the wiring harness is mounted up under the dash. I started running the wires. It actually, yeah, I got it um, cranking off the key and I got the ignition hooked up, like sprayed the brake cleaner down it. Got a fire out of it yesterday, so yeah, that's happening. Got the brake lines fitted. Um, just sort of let them gravity bleed. Um, and yeah, got the fuel lines run. It's all clamped up under the chassis, so yeah, really happy with that. So gonna go ahead and um, yeah, keep rough rough running the wire for now. Um, yeah, make sure that's all good, where I'm gonna clamp it, work all that out. Um, and then probably, yeah, get some fuel in it, see if, get the fuel pump working, see if it, um, the fuel system's all good, um, get to a point where I can run it, make sure all the other like cool lines and stuff are good. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. Got to work out, actually got to work out this park brake lever assembly too. So yeah, another job. Alrighty, yeah, so it's the next day. Um, yeah, got all the wiring sort of roughed out to the rear. All the lights are working in the case, tail lights break, all that jazz. Um, got some fuel in the tank, uh, powered up the fuel system mounted the fuel filter um, yeah no leaks in the fuel system which was good um, actually had the engine running for a little bit yesterday Mark came down gives a hand so he fired it up um, yeah run the front harness the headlights indicators work all in the front obviously nothing's finalized it's just been rough run um, late yesterday I've slash last night um, end up fitting the coolant temp sensor and the oil pressure sensor new sensors there so I got to wire them up this morning um, I've made the um, the universal wipe motors fit in this thing, so I've got to finish that off. Uh, I've got to run a Versalite wiring, um, work out how off that shift, how I'm going to trigger the reverse lights. Um, and yeah, stack of other little jobs to do. Um, still haven't touched the handbrake system yet, but yeah, we'll try and button most of the wiring up before we um, take on that handbrake system. But yeah, let's get into it, eh? Oh yeah, it's Sunday morning, so yeah, spent most of the week on uh, Mark's truck. Got it loaded up. Um, yeah, sorry I didn't get to film a bit more for you. Uh, just mainly focused on getting the work done. Um, and like I said, it wasn't a big project. It was mainly just all the plumbing. So yeah, it's running and driving there. Brakes, handbrake, all that jazz. So yeah, let's go and deliver this thing, eh? Rightio, so I was just going through um, editing this video and I realised I hadn't um, filmed, well, a hell of a lot of it, uh, actually. Um, and I didn't probably go into a lot of detail as to exactly what I did to Mark's Chevy. So, basically, yeah, I had to wire it up, uh, plumb it up, um, 
the intake manifold wasn't bolted on or it didn't have a shifter in it so yeah went ahead first thing i did was yeah reseal the intake manifold put the carby on it mount the accelerator cable um put the extractors on it i mounted the shifter and the shifter cable kick down cable didn't have any hard brake lines in it so i made the brake lines ran all those um didn't have a drive shaft in it so fitted that um installed the wiring harness wired it from scratch installed the headlights tail lights uh installed fuel pump ran fuel lines transmission oil cooler lines and then um yeah wired up the gauges fitted the it had a um came a little universal handbrake kit so i fitted that ran the cables ran all that um and basically yeah delivered the truck as a run and driving stopping uh vehicle it had none of that before it came it was just the the bones of everything so yeah um so i just wanted to reiterate what i um actually got done on the truck and uh that was done inside of a week um yeah i was pretty wrapped with it mark was really happy with it so um yeah just sort of i thought i'd go in a bit more detail because i um i kind of just hooked in and got the work done i didn't um did make a big deal out of video on it but yeah just thought i'd um let you know uh the extent of the work because yeah i did a bad job of filming all right yeah so i got the chevy dropped off back at mark's place um yeah just come up to my uncle's i'll um guess i'll introduce you to the newest member of the fleet yeah as 110 um got some big ideas for this thing not sure haven't committed anything yet but um yeah really excited to um get stuck into this thing haven't um never really even seen one of these before i bought it um thanks Luki. and yeah um just um pretty cool like like i said it's, an, it's not this thing's not a truck like it's yeah obviously it's a cute butte so a bit of a special car but um someone had this thing on a holding frame before it's been the file on the floor has been chopped up um like i say not committed to any anything just yet i'm um, weighing up all my options but definitely thinking um got a yeah international v8 there and probably gonna run that and yeah but um like i said nothing nothing finalized yet but thought i'd introduce you to it guys i'm not sure when i'm gonna get to it um but we got it and yeah it's another one to um, come to the channel so yeah thanks again for watching everyone um like i said sorry about the short video but um i just want to get stuck in and get that job done for mark so um yeah got that done got it back to him so yeah thanks for watching like share and subscribe i'll catch you on the next one